Tammy, thanks for coming out to the clinic. I hope you got a lot out of it. We're going to start off looking at your underwater video here. Uh, just a few things I want to point out to you. Uh, when you're breathing, it's causing you to, to start your pull in the opposite arm too early. So you have a nice, you have a nice uh, glide right there and there. And then when you breathe, you start that pull too soon. And you're, and when you start your pull too soon, you tend to be on your side and you're pulling straight down. And it's the weakest position you can pull from. So it's real important that when you're breathing, that you maintain that glide position with the opposite arm until you actually start to turn your head back in for the in from the breath. You can see how as you're turning and you're starting that pull before you're turning back in. It's real important to do that. Uh, you might want to consider doing a lot of catch-up freestyle uh, just to keep touching those hands until you can continue to can you do that continuously. Uh, the next thing you need to look at really uh, is two more things. You have uh, when you're pulling, you're pulling with a straight arm. Look at the look how straight your arms are. The elbows are underneath the body. Uh, Got to get those arms bent. You just don't have the strength with a straight arm as you do as a bent arm. And you have to have the, sh the elbows outside the shoulders. So what's happening is you got to get that nice catch where you, you initiate the catch, bring the fingertips down, get the elbows up and out, and also over the hand and pull back. So you've got to bend that elbow as early as you can. If, it, if you have to do anything, just flare that elbow out. A lot of that's going to help if you slow down, if you get more of a catch or freestyle because you're just turning those arms over uh, almost continuously, really. Uh, the other thing is you don't, uh, well, you're having a pretty good rotation there and there. Look at the rotation, but it looks fine there. So the real key there is those arms are just sort of continually moving and you don't have the catch and your arms are very, very straight as you pull through. Okay, the above water here. Uh, what's happening is you're lifting the elbows up and then you're trying to bring the hand forward. Focus, um, I like to see you get the arms straighter, elbows out wider, and try to recover. Think about recovering the arm and bringing that forward, the elbow forward, uh, instead of bringing the hand forward, all right? Because that way you don't curl that arm around uh, as you are. You see how your left arm there, you're bringing the elbow up and then you're immediately trying to bring the hand forward. Just come up, bring the elbow up, and let the elbow lead the hand forward into the entry point. So that should help out a lot, and I wish you the best of luck.